Ladies and gentlemen, once upon a time, there was a princess, the only begotten child of the king. And this princess, as she grew older, the king began to worry that after his death there would be no heir to the throne. So he sent out his advisors throughout the land seeking an appropriate bridegroom for the princess. Each she turned away. The advisors came to her, and she looked at them and said, do you not fear God? Would you have me trespass against the one sure sign of providence that we have in this earth, namely, our desire? And the ministers and the advisors were afraid, and they left her alone. But in her loneliness, she became strange. The princess took to wandering the streets of the royal city at night, alone. One night, she met a stranger. The stranger wore a clothes of a man, but appeared to be a woman. She doffed her top hat, and written upon her forehead were strange symbols, the signs of the zodiac and the letters of the alphabet twisting and turning before her eyes. She was entranced and looked down into the pair of eyes before her, and she saw her own, her own eyes there. Suddenly, rains of fire began to fall upon the city. All of the spurned suitors had joined together to make war upon the imperial city. All around them was chaos. The stranger took the princess's hand and they ran, they ran and they ran until they found a crack in the walls and they squeezed their bodies through until on the other side they found their way deep into the forest. And they found a clearing there and they looked up and saw the twelve signs of the zodiac. And they looked around themselves, and they saw a menagerie of beasts, the doe and the fawn, and the baby rabbit, there, there to welcome the, the sacred guests. Oh, no, oh, 